Thanks, Ethan. Well, today I'm joined by Michael Maxwell at the Sioux City Public Library. Thanks so much for being here. Thank you for having me back. It's always a pleasure to be here. So we've talked a lot about Sioux City Reads. Now tell us more about the virtual author event coming up. Yeah, so it's really exciting on Wednesday the 28th, which these dates that I'm mentioning are all in this brochure that you can get at any library location, and the information's on our website as well. If you open it up here, the Wednesday 28th event is our first event with the author herself. So I'm really excited about this, this one. Um, we'll be speaking with Idra Novi. She is over on the East Coast. She'll be zooming in from uh, Brooklyn. and. We'll have her there and we'll get to hear from her on Wednesday. I'm really excited about that one. That's awesome. And can attendees ask the author questions? Good question. Yeah, so we are going to have an opportunity for folks to come to the library for an hour before the discussion on that Wednesday just to kind of uh, talk to one another about the book and give me the questions that they want me to then take to Idra. And I'd be happy to take your questions to her. She's very excited to hear um, what Sioux Cityans have received from the book and what they're wondering about as well. So it'll be fun. That's awesome. And if someone misses the virtual event, will they have another chance to hear from the author? Yeah, that's a really good question. So Idra Novi's been so generous with her time. Um, she's even actually made it possible for us to have a few uh, copies of the book to give away at these events, I should also mention. So you might get a copy of the book for free. Uh, but she will be joining us again on March 30th, and we're actually having an event at the Art Center. So the Sioux City Art Center is hosting that one. And there will be a little reception beforehand with some snacks and refreshments. Everyone's invited in to come and look at the art, because if you've had a chance to read Take What You Need, um, you'll know that art plays a big part of it. So we really wanted people kind of experiencing the art in our own backyard before we go to once again hear from um, Idra Novi. And she's going to be uh, speaking to us once again over Zoom but she's gonna be on the big screen in the auditorium at the Art Center. And at that one, we're gonna have a town hall style question and answer session. So if you haven't had a chance to read the book yet or you're still developing your questions, don't worry, you don't need to have them ready by the 28th. There'll be another opportunity to ask them uh, on March 30th. For people who haven't read the book, uh, tell me about it, what, what's it about? Yeah, so Take What You Need by Idra Novi is the Sioux City Reads book this year. And um, if you recall, that's the process where we have Sioux Cityans vote for their favorite of a few titles. And this was the winner, so Sioux City selected this book. It's a novel about a relationship between a stepmother and a stepdaughter, and it's told from both of their perspectives. And they've both kind of grown apart and be, been alienated from each other over the years. And at the beginning of the book, the stepdaughter basically finds out that the stepmother's passed away. And she has to go um, from her life back to rural Pennsylvania to kind of uh, pick things up and see what happened. So it's a really good family story. It's a really good kind of culture clash story. And it's a really good story about somebody who's a creative. I loved being in the mind of, of Jean, the stepmother character, who's the artist of the story. And then some other events going on. Tell me about the family history collage and sewing sessions. Yeah, so I'm glad you asked about those. Since the book deals with um, an artist and creativity and how each of us can practice that in our own lives, we wanted to make sure that our, our programs for Sioux City Reads this year were also very creative. We've been lucky to also part with, partner with the Art Center on this Razzle Dazzle installation art piece project they're doing with the artist Amanda Browder. And she's hosting some of her really popular sewing sessions at our Sioux City Public Library location downtown. So be sure to check when those are. Um, those are also something that people have had a lot of fun with. Um, and I think if you want to get into some of the stuff that this book maybe has inspired you to pursue, it's a way to do that. Um, I would also say the Family History Collage Program, we have another one coming up. We did one a couple weeks ago and it was so much fun. We, all did, we had seven of us in there just sitting, chatting up a storm and, and putting together these Family History Collages. We're doing another one on March 3rd, completely free to participate. That runs from 2 to 4 p.m. on that Sunday afternoon and you can come in whenever you want. We have all the supplies for you. You just bring your family memorabilia or any craft supplies that you'd like to provide for yourself. And we brought the fun. Thank you so much for being here yeah, today. Thank you.